What is up? Welcome to 2007 Bra, and today we're going to be looking at the most ridiculous version of Windows yet. Windows XP was so awesome, but Microsoft did it again with a whole new look. Let's dive into Windows Vista in this episode of Relook. Vista is a version of Windows that succeeded the hugely popular Windows XP. It introduced a new look with many programs and features that made it more personal and modern. Its development cycle was long and treacherous, and with codename Longhorn proving to become too bloated, it became what Microsoft did not want. Windows Vista introduced a whole new look, named Arrow. It introduced transparent window borders, new animations, and eye candy. Many elements of Arrow are still found in Windows today. Icons were given a new standard size, allowing developers to give programs more complex and artistic icons. The start menu features a new look along with a system-wide search bar. Windows Explorer also sees a new interface. Windows Vista is most well known for its performance on all PCs. <laughs> Just kidding! Windows Vista introduced new technologies and various features that most PCs of the time couldn't handle. Arrow's visual effects did not run very well on many graphics cards, and many drivers straight up didn't work on Vista, rendering devices like printers useless. These problems got so bad that Microsoft was forced to allow users to downgrade to Windows XP. Many of these issues were eventually fixed in updates, but it wasn't enough to spare Windows Vista as the title as one of the worst versions of Windows ever. Despite compatibility, other features of Vista made it problematic. User Account Control, or UAC, constantly nagged users with pop-ups. Windows Vista's generally unfinished feel comes from its rocky development cycle. Microsoft was working on Codename Longhorn before scrapping it due to it becoming bloated and buggy. With such a short time to complete the project, Microsoft had to rush Windows Vista to marketing, causing Vista to immediately have problems from launch. However, most of the problems are fixed in future service packs, allowing Vista to become much more usable. However, nothing Microsoft could do could spare Windows Vista, the title as one of the worst versions of Windows to date. Unfortunately, the popularity of Windows XP kept Vista from reaching its full potential. As people began to try Vista, they truly realized it was a nice operating system. However, with the release of Windows 7, Vista soon lost its chance. Support for Windows Vista ended on April 11th, 2017, making it supported for 10 years. Well, that's it. Thanks for watching. And make sure to see us in the next Relook. Relook.